shipping on everything when it comes to shoes, accessories, and fashions. So if you've got your great Diane Gilman clothes, you gotta have great shoes to go with them. And I do believe we've got a great lineup for you. We're gonna kick it off. It's that time of year. We yearn to switch into our fall shoes. We're gonna have a little bit of fall coming up in this hour, and then we'll do some summer sale prices, so stick around to see those. But first, it's Born, and this is the Gaelic Boat Leather Loafer. Three colors, that's the cognac you're looking at. We have a navy, and we have a black. Sizes six through 11, whole half sizes between six and a half and size 10. And you guys have voted this a favorite. It's a customer pick. It Hello, Miss Karen. Hello, how are and you? And how are you? I am très bien. Oh, Merci. oui, oui. <laughs> oh, she knows French. Oh, that's gonna catch me well, on that one. Here's the thing, <laughs> this is why, this is why you guys love the Gaelic bow loafer by Born. I'm gonna tell you right off the bat. Look, look at this. Look <laughs> at the flexibility. I can literally ball this up. This is the most supple, soft, lightweight, driving mock that you will ever slip on your foot. It's literally like wearing a slipper. Why is it like that? Well, it's the way that we've constructed the shoe. First of all, Born is known for its full grain leather, that buttery, soft, supple leather that just caresses and cocoons your foot. That's nothing but full grain leather touching your foot. What we've done is we've added in some design details. We start with this puckered stitching that comes around the toe box, this nice little detail here. We've added an elegant leather bow, just a little dash of pizzazz something a little subtle and sophisticated. The leather coverage right here comes up your foot about four inches. So you're getting a little less coverage than perhaps a traditional loafer, which makes it easy, breezy, and lightweight as we transition into those colder months. You're getting the closed toe construction. But here's what makes this shoe so absolutely comfortable and fabulous. I'm gonna flip it over. Look at the pegged rubber sole. This pegged rubber sole, each one of these little rubber pegs, it's literally like a spring, a boing, boing spring with a bounce back effect. Not only is it sporty, but it gives you great traction when you move around in these shoes. And I gotta tell you, Suzanne, I just got back from London. I walked for miles in these shoes. It had the surface grip from, all, you know, so a lot of times, like especially the older parts of London with the cobblestones. No, sure. Great to grip, super soft and sub supple. Wait, you know what I thought you were gonna say? This darn interior. <laughs> oh, well, you want to you want to talk about the well, interior? Well, I was like, yeah, I was like, oh, I know she's going to go interior. Then you went to the bottom, which totally makes sense, right? Because it's right. a great feature. Well, you know but I, mean? I really thought this interior is yes. insane. Well, I went to the bottom <laughs> because it really sets this driving mock apart Absolutely. from others. Absolutely. But let's talk about the footbed because that is what Bourne is known for. Wow. Is our pillowy soft walking on a cloud footbed? Oh my god. So you're pressing into. Well, but here, why don't we both kind of. I've been, I've been, fingers, I've right? been pushing it. Like, I've been like, you do. You just kind of want to squeeze. Sort of massaging it, it really. It is. It's kind of like a sensory experience, <laughs> it is. right? It's, it's very great. soothing. Look at this. Look at this. Look but how crazy. See how deep your fingers are pressing into that footbed? And it's I mean, all the way down here and all the way back right. to the back. That's right. Ooh, that's so what you're looking at right now is a dual density footbed. It's what Born is known for, mm. and this footbed is lined in microfibers. So it's a very moisture wicking suede like effect. Inside of this footbed right here, you'll notice that we built in an art support. You can see right here that gives you that extra added support. As we flip this shoe, this shoe over, I also wanna show you that that rubberized sole comes up over the heel so it protects the heel from scuffing. It's literally like a driving box. Yeah, and okay. again, look, I, I mean, come on. something out. Look at that. Because if you haven't looked at your screen and looked over that way beyond Karen <laughs> and down <laughs> below Karen, these are $40 off, okay? Uh, yeah. Crazy. That is the best price and the lowest price we've ever offered. And here's the thing, it's a customer pick and the reviews are great. I love this, Amy in South Carolina says, pair these loafers with with anything. That's right. This is one of my favorites. It's called Born to Shop in PA. That's my kind of girl. She <laughs> says, I bought the blue, which we have. She mm -hmm. said, great with jeans. The first day I wore them right out of the box. There's literally zero break-in. Zero break-in. Yeah. And remember, you have nothing but full grain leather cocooning your foot, which makes this an incredible price for the quality of leather that you're getting on your foot. And you know, that all day comfort. One of the reasons why the, the loafer is so lightweight and flexible is because we use an old world method of construction known as a panka. What is that? That is a hand stitch that we do on the shoe. It stitches together all the components of the shoe, the upper, the footbed, and the sole, all together 
in a single hand stitch. Mm. And that means that we don't have any glues or adhesives to stiffen and weigh the shoe down, which gives it that flex that I can literally ball up, right? But it also, that Opanka stitching makes our shoes durable, which means they're gonna last year after year and season after season. And because this driving mock is such an iconic style, it never goes out of style. And you know this, I mean, the driving mock is a, a shoe wardrobe essential. Everybody needs 100%. a driving mock in their shoe. And it's such it? an easy go-to, too. It and really it's is. born, for gosh sakes. I mean, <laughs> if you really want to wear comfortable shoes that feel good all day long, no matter if you're going five feet or 500 feet or 500 miles, it's a born shoe. Mm -hmm. And we do have a lot of comfort shoes here at HSN, but you're right. The quality and the attention to detail, I think, is what re really separates born. And that's why they just have such a following and such favorites. Absolutely. Um, Donna, you can see your whole outfit. A good part of it, I believe it's all Diane Gilman, actually. So if you want to get the look, you sure can. We'll help you out with that. But here's the story. We are $40 off on these. And you guys have voted these as one of your favorites. So if you've watched or you have born, or maybe you're trying born for the first time, I don't think there's a better opportunity than this, quite frankly, because these are $100 pair of loafers. And get it. It's worth it. To your point, Karen, you're not wearing these five minutes. You're wearing these five, ten years. That's right. They're designed that well. And boy, once you slip your foot into it for the first time, then I think you become a big born fan. You really do. It's, yeah. it's like wearing slippers. You, it's, it's almost like you're cheating. You're out and about all day long in beautiful shoes that feel like you're in your slippers, your right. best pair of slippers. Right now, I'm holding up the black, and I just want to show you that this is a bit different because this is all over black. This is monochromatic. Oh, that means nice. that we have the full grain black leather match dyed to the footbed and the sole is also match dyed. Again, that pegged rubber sole that gives you that boing boing spring in your step that makes us so sporty and so practical to wear. And that just gorgeous dainty little bow that adds a touch of sophistication and elegance without being you know, overly uh, trendy or overly embellished. True, that's mm -hmm. very true. Now, why is the leather so incredibly buttery soft? The leather is so incredibly buttery. Again, again don't you want to pet the leather? I do. I, do. <laughs> I am 100% fondling these shoes. It's so almost embarrassing. <laughs> I've been between this and touching this and rubbing the leather. It's almost getting embarrassing. Well, the reason just, why... There's such a tactile feel it's to tactile. it all. tactile. You've yeah. said it. And the reason why you just want to caress the leather, this is a full grain leather. That comes from the top top portion of the hide. Okay. That top layer of an animal hide has the natural striations, the natural graining. It is the most supple, softest, highest quality part of the hide. That means that when we manufacture these shoes, we don't have to treat it. Lesser quality leather, you have to sand and treat and really manipulate mm. to get that softness. Well, we are buying the best, the best. leather, so yeah. it's naturally supple. And I want to wrap this up on Babe's comment from Delaware. She says the leather is very soft, speaking of it. She said you can't go wrong with born shoes. Well, worth the money. Well, babe, if you thought they were well worth it at $100, my gosh, they're really a bargain at $56.25. So, babe, thank you for your compliment and your comment.